This pie plays second only to pumpkin for Thanksgiving Day, but play your cards right and you can have Southern Pecan Pie once this month and maybe once the next. Marguerite Henderson is sharing this favorite with us. It's great to see you. That pie is yeah. stunning. And I feel like pecan pie puts on almost an air of sophistication because yes. not everybody can do it well. Well, and this is so easy. There's no excuse not to make your own pecan pie. Okay, so let's go over pie crust first. Yes. Okay, okay. There are four different ways you could do the pecan pie. One, you can make your own pie crust, which if you're really experienced in the kitchen, it's, it's a matter of 20 seconds of the Cuisinart. I'm gonna take the next option. Okay, all right, the next option is that you go out and you buy the rolled up version. Okay. Okay, and then you unroll it mm -hmm. and then put it in your own pie tin. I can do okay. that. Okay, third option is what something we're gonna do today is because we're gonna put this in the oven you here. You dressed it up. I dressed it up with these cute little leaves on the side and, and you can I, buy these things. So I've seen these everywhere, these little okay. crust toppers. Yeah, right, so you press down on them. You can buy them in all your local, um, little gourmet shops uh -huh. and then you you press them and then you pull them out and then you just put them on your pie. You're layering these kind of around yeah, the edge. Yeah, around the edge so nobody knows that you bought this pie. Look how cute. They bake up so So cute. Nice as yeah. Well. And then um, then you have a pumpkin for your pumpkin pie and you've got that over there. Oh, where anyway, did you get these? These are those uh, William Sonoma. Oh, cute. Um, and then your fourth option is to go and buy a pie. Well, I'm, but, I've done that too in years past. I'm not <laughs> going to tell a lie about okay. my pie. <laughs> All right, so here we go. Pecan not tell pie. A pie lie. <laughs> Four eggs, about a cup of sugar. You can make it three fourths of a cup of sugar if you don't want it so sweet because we're putting Cairo in here. So okay. you want to beat this up and get it so that it's sort of frothy. And this is going to make that wonderful custardy filling. See, and that's the ticket is that oh, smooth yeah. texture. Yeah. So I'm going to just put that down for a second and start adding all the other stuff. So we're going to add two tables, two teaspoons, I'm sorry, of flour. Okay. A pinch of salt. Uh-huh. Okay. Oh, uh, about a teaspoon of vanilla extract and use a really good one. Don't use imitation. I use knew you'd say that. <laughs> <laughs> I knew it was coming before the words even left her okay. mouth. Okay, and this is that really good stuff that makes it southern. It's a little bourbon that I took oh. from home. So. Okay. You know, if the day gets really bad, you can... You can I noticed it wasn't completely full. Do you want to you weigh in on that? About two <laughs> teaspoons of that. And then um, some pecan pieces. Okay. So this, whoa, we're going to um, beat this up. Oh, about 30 seconds. Okay, so just a little whisk. Yeah, just a little beat. Okay. And then we just... Add those little pieces in there. These are the whole pecans. I was glad to hear you say pecan. I know some pecans, true southerners say pecan, but pecan, pecans, whatever. That's it. I mean, <gasps> really, really. I mean, the trick is. Oh, hold on. I'm Did, sorry. The one thing I forgot. The caro. The caro syrup, which really makes that gooey, ooey, gooey it center. Gives you that extra sweetness. Yeah. Did you toast your pecans at all or just put them in you raw? No, I don't because I'm baking them, you know, so yeah. you're already going to get them toasted so in the save oven. A step. So, yeah, that'll be enough. What do, what do people ask you to bring to Thanksgiving dinner? I mean, oh, the whole meal comes to mind, but no, what's your assignment? I, I am the um, queen of Thanksgiving. I, I knew it. I knew that before asking you as well. That is my favorite holiday. So you just so jump right in? I do it all, and I don't want anybody to bring anything. <laughs> Oh, no, really, I just, you know what I... What a great hostess. I like you. <laughs> I wrote to someone one year, and I said, just bring your appetite. And they read it as appetizers. Oh. So they brought this whole tray of appetizers, and I was like, no. No, just I have you. my own. Thank just you. you. Oh, here's another thing you can do. They, this is also at Williams Sonoma. So this, if you want, if you're super creative and you want to make it um, festive, you roll out your pie dough like this, and you put this on top of this, okay? And it gives you the top And effect. then you roll it out, <gasps> and then you take that whole thing, and you put it on top of your pie. Oh my gosh, that, I love the detail this year on all I of the know. pie toppers. I know, I mean, so how easy is that? You don't have to do any cutouts. So that is another option, and you will just, you'll be the queen of, of pie. You won't be the queen of Thanksgiving because that role is already taken. The crown is assigned, but you might be the, the princess of, of pie. Okay. Hey, we forgot one thing. What? The butter. Oh, gotta have the butter. But you know what? I've got. But you proved We've easy enough, basic ingredients. Yep. And look we at can these do it. beautiful pies to just end. Just if I do this now, you can squeeze this in the oven. Oh, Marguerite, great job. What's coming up on your website? You're in full baking mode, I'm sure. 
Uh, yes, well, I you should get online and you could get recipes for the rest of the holidays. Nice. And go to MargaretHenderson.com, sign up for my newsletter, and I will give you step-by-step -step instruction on what to do. And we're anxiously waiting for class schedules for 2017. We're not rushing it. I know you're busy, but classes filled up so fast this year that there are a lot of people wanting to get on her list for next year. So don't leave us hanging too long. Well, I'm retiring. No! Yes! No! Yes! It's true? Yes. At the end of the year? Yeah. Well, now I'm going to cry. Well, it's cooking classes, but I'll still be doing... <laughs> You know, my TV, and I'll be doing a lot of things. Oh my other gosh, things, I'm starting so. a petition if you want to sign it. Bring back Marguerite. I'm happy for you. You've, you've helped us with our food, with our food yeah. passion and hobby for so long. Yeah. So, so good for you. I'll be, but I'll be here. Keep okay. that newsletter though on that website on yeah. your dial. Thank you. Happy Thanksgiving, my okay, friend. Okay, you too.